All right, Mr. Curtis, Logan Stout at Perkins Motorplex in Mayfield. I'm kind of behind the scenes here. This is outside one of our reconditioning facilities. And this is that awesome red 18 F-150 XLT with the two-tone uh, paint with the red and gray. Uh, if you take a look, that American flag way over there, that is where our lot is located here in Mayfield, where the traditional lot with, you know, where people drive up and our sales offices and all that. All of this back here is like surplus inventory and inventory that we ship out to our other stores. And like I said, reconditioning facilities are back here, our service centers, all that stuff. So this is behind the scenes. And man, I am very uh, pleased with this truck. Uh, the curb appeal obviously is a 10 out of 10 as you look at it uh, from right here. But even when we get close, I'm very pleased. Like all of our vehicles are used. We don't expect any of them to be perfect ever. Uh, and this one's not perfect. There'll, there'll be dings, scratches, whatever. And I'm going to do my best to point them out. But um, man, very, very pleased with it so far. So looking down the driver's side, I'm not seeing any waviness in the paint, major dings, scratches, anything like that. Running boards are firm. Uh, awesome fuel wheels. Those Ridge Grappler tires that we love here, 100% tread. Those are brand new. And uh, yeah, it's just sitting really really nicely uh the running boards kind of have that chrome on the side matches the handles uh then you got the black wheels to go with the gray uh it's just a really good look the front of it looks great not a lot of rock packs bug damage anything like that there are a few bugs on it you can tell that it was on a test drive the other day uh but obviously those will come right off and as far as like you know like across the hood i don't see any hail damage nothing major a few tiny little like rock packs that have been touched up and stuff through there but nothing significant there let's go passenger side i want to look right down the body lines for anything i see through here i got nothing very very nice all right while i'm here let's go ahead and do the frame let's take a look underneath a little easier to see underneath this one than it is some of the other trucks obviously super clean I always look at this main frame line right here because we know if it's getting rust and corrosion then all the smaller lines are too uh and that is as clean as it gets that is perfect perfect parking sensors all look straight ahead back bumper looks good no odd spacing there tailgate looks good really nice bed cover we've seen these on uh, quite a few um, trucks and I did not check this before before I started recording but luckily that was super easy uh, like just like a couple little scrapes in there and that's it so this is a clean slate of a bed no cuts no liners you can do a spray in you can do a drop in whatever you want to do Let's go ahead and open this tailgate here this does have that nice seat back there or uh, step back there and so I had a customer was telling me one of the things he always does when he's shopping Ford trucks is he looks inside of this, he said, because a lot of times uh, the history of the truck will reveal itself here if you see rust and corrosion and stuff. But just dust, that's it. So I love that. And last truck I saw this kind of bed cover on, one of these undercovers, uh, it was a Ram and uh the it was one of the reasons why the customer was wanting to buy it is because he liked the undercover so much um and i see why now that was awesome all right so uh obviously you can take that off if you want and sell it but uh looks great let's go to the inside super clean back here doesn't smell like smoke, animal, anything like that. No stains in the headliner. Some grass in here maybe from the test drive. Seat backs look good. Great. Let's go to the inside here. Power seat. Did a little discoloring there on the side of the uh, armrest there in the middle. And let's get in there. 
everything appears to be in working order let's turn the air down uh you got somebody's sirius xm subscription still going so there you go you get that for as long as they <laughs> until they realize that their subscription's on a different truck you'll get that uh 41,778 miles as it sits that's important because that means it'll qualify for our factory type total care warranty which is so clutch on this because even though the vehicle has the lift and the wheel and the tire package that's on it um the total care that we sell still works with that so if you notice like if you go to a ford dealer uh th that'll be one of the things that they void the powertrain warranty with and the bumper to bumper with as they say well it's got a lift on it it's got aftermarket whatever uh not the case with our total care and it's a factory type total care so it's the overwhelming majority of that bumper to bumper coverage all the way until the vehicle has 120,000 miles on it there's no deductible it's parts and labor nationwide and it works at any certified mechanic. So it doesn't have to be a Ford dealer that works on it. Any place that wants to get paid to do the work, as long as it's an uh, insured certified mechanic, they can get paid to do the work. And I love that. That gives you flexibility on getting those appointments uh, to get things fixed. And it covers even computer stuff like the touchscreen, backup camera, parking sensors, uh, GPS navigation type stuff, um, all kinds of, uh, I call it... Uh, I usually call it computer crap. I don't know if that's the most <laughs> most professional thing to say, but I'll just say all the computer stuff, the computer modules, uh, ECM, PCM, stuff like that is covered. Uh, one thing I didn't do, and we'll finish there. Let's go underneath the hood real quick. I know it's going to be as clean as the rest because at this point, well, I guess I'd, I'd just be extremely shocked to see other thing, anything other than nice and clean under here. So let's check that out. If I can do this one-handed... Got to find it first. All right. Awesome. So I don't know an alternator from a radiator. I'm the last guy to kind of walk through and point out all that stuff, but I can look through the windows that the engine bay gives us here and just look for any signs of rust corrosion. And I can also listen. There's no knocking, no ticking nice and uh, stock quiet which is what you want let you customize a little further if you want but uh, there you go that's the 18 f-150 xlt uh, fog lights on the front I mean everything is ready to roll let me know what other questions you have